This is the Mike Slater Show. A better you for a better us. AM 760 KFMB. I want to talk about the road diet here. I want to make sure everyone's aware of this. I got a note here from Jason. It said, Slater, my friend just told me you were talking about road diets and Vision Zero. Here in Mar Vista, in West LA, we've been dealing with a road diet on Venice Boulevard for six months. We've had an increase in accidents, an increase in cut through traffic on our quiet residential streets, and all the businesses on Venice Boulevard are suffering. Our organization, Restore Venice Boulevard, has recently started a video series telling about the stories of struggling businesses uh, in Mar Vista. Uh, uh, we have businesses approaching us to appear in this series because the local politicians are completely ignoring them. We're releasing a new video every week. That's awesome. I haven't clicked the link yet, but I share that just so you know, not making this up. So here's the big picture about the road diet. Been going on for a couple years now in California. First, you need to know the motivating foundation of this. There's two. First, progressive politicians are on this crusade to save the planet from global warming. And then two, progressive politicians believe that they are smarter than you. All right, now, on this crusade to save the planet from global warming, one thing that they want to do in order to save the planet is to get you out of your car and into a trolley, right, into mass transit. Also, because they're smarter than you, they think uh, one thing that you should be doing is not driving your car and you should take the trolley. Now, I think every politician, when you're elected to office, should have to take the bus to work and home. You have to take the bus to work and from work every single day. That will happen for about two days before politicians stop their stupid fetish for buses and trolleys. Alas, we have the road diet. Uh, so the plan with the road diet, this is the stated expressed purpose. I can't express this enough. This is not my assessment. This is not my conservative. Eric, play the music. Do you have the conspiracy music? Okay, we don't play this music behind this segment. This is not a conspiracy theory. This is not my... Reading between the lines. <laughs> this is the express stated purpose of the road diet to make your driving and your commute so miserable, so oppressive that you have to go on mass transit. I can't take it anymore. So the goal, again, is to, uh, we're not, so, so part of the plan is to not spend any money on building new roads, certainly, or highways, and also to not fix anything. Because they don't want it to, they don't want your commute to be better. They want it to be worse. Now that's the big vision. Jerry Brown's talked about this. Others have talked about this. But that's a tough pitch, right? <laughs> the pitch of we're gonna make your commute even worse to save the planet. Eh, not a huge, no one's super stoked about that. So then they had to come up with this one. It's called Vision Zero. So Vision Zero, LA is the first to institute it as uh Jason wrote me a minute ago. Uh, Vision Zero is uh, the goal is to have zero traffic fatalities by 2025. Now, follow this. How are they going to do that? How are you going to eliminate all traffic fatalities in the second biggest city in the country? Well, you're going to force everyone to drive slower. Well, how do you force people to drive slower? You can lower the speed limit, but you know, no one's going to follow that. How do you force people to drive slower? Well, you increase traffic. How do you increase traffic? You take away car lanes and you put in extra bike lanes. Same number of cars have to go into now one lane instead of two or two instead of three. Everyone slows down. Everything slows down. Fewer fatalities. Right? And all these officials say that uh, when traffic slows down, streets will be safer for would-be bikers to work. Because, you know, I would ride my bike to work the, you know, 18 miles or whatever it is. If only. Yeah, I've been dying to break out the old 10 speed. <laughs> Pull it down the, the 805. That's it. Yeah. All right. So, uh, I'll get, there's two kickers here. The first, uh, Jason gave away a moment ago. As with all government projects or all government goals, uh, not only do they not achieve the goal, but the opposite is what happens. It's always the opposite. The exact opposite. So in Playa del Rey, which is one city that they've done this to, got rid of a got rid of a car lane, added a bike lane for no reason. Uh, by the way, no one's no one's using the bike lane. If there were hundreds of people who used the bike lane every day, we, we could talk. No one uses the bike lane, <laughs> but they don't care. They don't really want anyone to use the bike lane. They don't care about people using the bike lane. They just don't want you to drive anymore. They want it to be so miserable that you get in the bus. 
with the trolley. Anyway, in Playa del Rey, they used to have 11 accidents a year. Now they have they had 52 accidents in the first four months of the year. So a four to 500 percent increase in the number of accidents in a third of the time. And ambulances and fire trucks can't make it through the traffic because there's nowhere you can pull over. So response times have gone up as well. But politicians don't care because their goal is not to help you get to work faster or get home faster. It's to save the planet. And they're on a great moral crusade to do that. Driven by their insatiable arrogance. So that's Mission Zero, or sorry, Vision Zero. So look forward to that coming to a town near you. There's no better example of how politicians are not looking out for you than the road diet. No better example. You want your commute to be faster. They purposefully, intentionally are going through great lengths to make it slower. San Diego spent is spending $62.5 million on our road diet plan. I have no idea what that money is going to. $62.5 million to make your commute slower so that you ride the trolley, which goes nowhere near my house to nowhere near I want to go. But thanks.